was like, fuck, dog. This motherfucker's definitely walking too fucking close, dog. I'm like, goddamn, bro. I almost hit him in the head with the fucking weight. He fucking swells up and walks down the aisle like I gotta get out the fucking way of him. If you want to meet me, if you want to say what's up, just say what's up. First of all, you walk too close to me, right? And he just keeps on walking. I, I said it loud enough where the fucking dude could definitely hear me. And I was like, goddamn, bud, I think the guy's got a crush on me. I think he's sweet on me or something, man. And he fucking <laughs> walks super close up on me, man. It's just fucking weird, dog. And nobody says excuse me. If you square up, fucking swole up, and just walk down the fucking aisle and make everybody get out your way, you're a dickhead. Now, I know you boys are probably like, man, you're probably tripping, dog. It probably wasn't that serious. You're right. It probably wasn't that serious. So you probably don't fucking know no better. I like to have a little bit of personal space. That's all. We're all trying to get better. You know what I'm saying? I ain't no punk, but I'll, I'll meet you halfway going down an aisle. You know, no harm, no foul, dog. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up, man? What's up? Shout out Rocky Strong. Fucking Rocky's crazy, man. What's up? Man? Yeah, bro. What's I up, love bro? it, man. I love it. Uh, I threw that, man. I was watching one of his lives one day, and he was going into that whole story. I yeah. was like, bro, I gotta take that. I gotta clip that up. <laughs> you gotta get that. <laughs> I clipped it up like it. I, I the whole story, bro. I rearranged everything. You know what I mean? I just I made it into a whole bunch of little clips and just tossed it here, there, and everywhere, man. Try to make it make sense. You know what I mean? Right. That's the most fun of making clips out of other people, bro, is because you could you can make them say all this shit. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah, I try, yeah. I, I try not to, yeah, I try not to ever make them look like bad. You know what I'm saying? But like, it just <laughs> ma it's it's makes it more funny when you can switch it around a little bit. Yeah, you know? like that right. that story was told in a whole different progression, bro. <laughs> What's up with you, man? You've been running, 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 trying to get here, huh? Fucking running around trying to get here, man. And then when I get here, something else came up, and I was like, "Fuck!" What's up, Will B? What's up, everybody? Wayne Sword, Jimmy Buckley. Yeah, bro. Call them out. Call them out. Everybody up in here. What's going yeah, on? A bunch of people in here, man. They they they've been waiting Mommy on the thunder. thunder. Yes. Excuse me, Anna. Thunder. Yep, yep, yep. I know. Appreciate you guys coming in. Sorry about Rob, being late. Sorry about Rob all this business. In here early. Rob probably left, though. He probably got too late for him, bro. Rocky oh, Strong yeah, yeah. was in here, but he... That's right, that's right. What's up, Andrew? I see you. Salute to all the real ones. Smash that like button. That's right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. I don't know the sneeze, but bless you, bless you. Oh, no, that was a half-ass half <laughs> call, bro. I was trying to, trying to keep it back, man. I'm trying to keep it back. Right, right. So, Anna, Anna Love Works. Anna Love Works. Hey, it's good to see you, Wayne Sword, man. It's been a minute, been a few days. Mm -hmm. Daniel Berry, what's that? Nicola? Michelle. Michelle, my first, first live. Right on. That's what's up. Ah, Daniel Berry well, Sports Highlights, right on, right on. Welcome to being corrupted. Yeah. <laughs> corrupted and crusted. And then we keep it. kicking. We, get, we just keep kicking. What happened? Uh, yeah. Um, Keep well, kicking. I a, Keep kicking. I had a whole lot of a whole lot of shit going on over here too, slowing me down too, man. So oh, it wasn't just you today, you know what I mean? Like All I, was, right. uh, I was the same way, man. I was over here you know, kicking the table and stuff. Like uh, yeah. stuff just don't always work how it's supposed to work. All right, you guys want to see something real quick? Always, bro. Always. No. Hold on, let me put you on this solo, no low. Hey, look at that guy. Look at his face. What you about to go to no, prom, bro? No damn hair <laughs> on it. <laughs> hey, damn, my, bro. My Earnhardt thing right there, too. Yeah, yeah that's wild, man. Wow, bro. What's <laughs> that, like 88? Nah, that was 90s. That was, was early 90s. That's what's up? Early what's 90s. up, Shiesty? Shiesty Poo, orale. Orale. What's up, Anna? Orale. <laughs> I was telling some folks yesterday, man. Uh, I was talking to some of the friends on here. I asked them, I was like, yo, do you guys get served the Spanish ads or um on, on YouTube? Right. And it was like it was like, nah. I was like, man, <laughs> I don't know what it is, but like I'll be getting served all these Spanish ads. 
on YouTube, bro. Like, really? I don't, I don't speak Spanish. You know what I mean? I don't know what they're saying to me, bro. But they steady be serving me. Like, every other ad is like a Spanish ad, bro. They straight like, think you're a paisa or what? I Damn. don't know, man. Cause like <laughs> I talked to I talked to a couple people who are Mexican, you know what I mean? And they're like, nah, I don't get them ads either. Wow. I'm like, what? I'm like, what the fuck, bro? Why they why they giving them to me? Like something oh. you hit, something you did. My Spanish is a poquito. Damn, Mucho that's... poquito. <laughs> My Spanish. Uh, Mucho poquito. Poquito, <laughs> poquito. Just a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, not enough. Just just like most of everything else I know, just enough to get me in trouble. I yeah. agree, Lil B. Bernard is the best ever. Hey Z, what's that? Yeah, boy. It's good to see you, man. Ruxia. This, this one this one right here got started late, bro. We we both the panel, running running on ball time right. today. But, um, yeah, this is a, it's a crazy day, man. I don't know if you yeah. saw my live earlier. Fucking the neighbor at work, fucking his house went up in flames, bro. Fucking crazy day, man. Yeah. Uh, the neighbor went up in flames. The, his house went up in flames, bro. How close is that to your house? Okay, no, not 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 at my house. At work. Oh, at work because I work in Fontana. That's a it's a truck. It's like truck um, central, you know, right. and fucking uh. So we, we sell truck parts, and right next door, there's a couple of houses. Well, one of the guys has a house there and a big old yard where he pulls in tra trailers and, and trucks, and he works on them in his backyard right there, you know? It's like a, it's like a yard. It's a, you know, it's all, it's all asphalt and shit, but he's, he has his house on the property, and, it, and it's not a big house or whatever, and the guy's a really good guy, you know, and that's how he makes his, his money and shit. And fucking, um, dude, I, he, he, I hope he wasn't home. Uh, because I didn't never I didn't see him and I, hopefully he wasn't asleep or in there and I don't think he was, but um, his whole house went up in flame, bro. His whole yeah. house, I was like, dude, the that's burnt down because they didn't stop it. That's everything he has. Well, some, one thing about okay, first of all, L.A. is is having the Santa Ana winds right now, so we right. got we got winds blowing through. But Fontana is is like the windiest place in the Inland Empire. Or yeah. one of the wind, windiest places. Like we were, we were supposed to have seventy mile an hour winds today, you know. All right. So that didn't help the fire, you know. It just yeah. fucking kept it, you know, going and going and spreading and shit, man. It was crazy. I felt so bad, man. What's up, oh, man. That's wild, bro. I can't imagine. I mean, like everything you got. If you ain't yeah, got it, that's basically safe, what happened. Fireproof safe, bro. It's gone. Right. And he and, and one of the guys told me he likes to just keep cash. I was like, I hope he had a fucking fireproof safe, bro. Yeah, you know? And if you're keeping a lot of cat, man, you know what I mean? You need a big ass safe, bro. Right. I'm in a I'm in a tornado warning or watch or something right now. Oh, right man. now? Like all I can hear over my headphones is the rain beating and the thunder. Bro. Oh shit. It's, can you hear it? <clears throat> no. It sounds like static to me, bro. I can't really hear it. Good. Damn. Good. There been a couple booms, bro, that I thought for sure you would have heard. Really? Loud, man. Um, I don't know, bro. If all the power goes out, shit gets crazy in here. You know what I mean? Wish me, wish me the best. I wish you the best what's all up? the time, bro. What's up, Wanda? I haven't seen you in a minute. Wanda, what's going on, Wanda? Hey, AZ. Oh. Um, you still in here, AZ? Yeah, I think he is. Alabama gets a lot of tornadoes. Wow. She said. Shit, I'm not I'm in so Alabama right now, though. Yeah. Well, they've been crazy wind. I've never seen one like this before. Yeah. I saw a wind blowing in California today, bro. Like, it was wild. I did see something about that today. Yeah. If I'm making all kinds of weird faces, it's because of my fucking allergies. Thanks to these winds, fucking okay. <clears throat> hey. the allergies all happening and shit. Since it's been getting warmer, man, every day that's how I've been. I've been waking up every day, just the head hurts, like nose running. Oh, fuck, that. Just, oh yeah, it's just distracting, you know. What's up, What's up Jake? What's up, Nate Zilla, Carlos? Zilla? All right, hang on. I'm gonna blow my nose. I'm just gonna mute it. All right. The memories of Crusty. 
It's lost. Um, I've heard some of their memories, man. I've heard them talk about a few of their memories. The wins? No, no, no. About Krusty in East L.A. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, did you get to check that out? I, I watched some of it, bro. Yeah, I watched some of it. I didn't finish it. I was watching it. Was it's crazy because I, I, I was looking at it yesterday. That's and hail like, right there, bro. What happened? I hear, I hear hail. Now? Ice. Yeah, I hear it. it I can't hear it. Side. Let me turn this up. No, I can't hear shit. Wow. Yeah. I believe you, though. <laughs> wow. What's up, Burkenu? Can you hear it? Michael? No, bro. I can't. I hear it, man. Hey, yeah, it's hell. Sounds pretty yeah. fierce, huh? Yeah, it's getting wild over here, bro. Um, Damn. What's up, Megan? <laughs> yeah, what's up, everybody? Sorry, I'm over here tripping out on the weather, man. I yeah. turn this shit right down. That sucks, man. I had my levels right. And then I yanked up the, the, the game. Try to be able to hear that hell. Now I'm probably gonna end up echoing this on stupid. Yeah, I, it, it was raining all day here, and then it quit raining, and all of a sudden it went to 80 degrees real quick, and it felt nice out, man. <coughs> and then now it's back to all this. What's up, Angie baby? We got what's up, Mike? Um, we got we got warm today too. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's windy and fuck, but I think the wind kept it cool. It's supposed to be like 70 something. No, that's about the perfect. You know, it was supposed to be at least 70 or something like that, but yeah, that wind is just kicking up today, bro. Yeah, I yeah, appreciate that, Michael. Yeah, definitely hit that right light man up in the right corner, three dots in the right corner. Thank you, Coco, the truth spitter. That's that right, Mike. Right quick, man. Um, Man, you know what? I, bro, I totally spaced it, man. I had all that other stuff going on before the live started. And I totally forgot what we even talked about talking about, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, man. I can't even. Hey, but um, I did hear something interesting today, though, man. Uh, Spill it out. Let's see. A Andrew Tate and his brother. Like, look, I'm not, I'm not 100% on all the facts, right? But. You know how Andrew Tate and his brother, they got locked up in some of the country for a minute. Um, they were trying to charge them with the, the, the uh, sexual crimes and stuff, like crimes against Oh, really? Okay. Who, who's, who, who are these guys, though? Andrew Tate, he's like the Sigma male, like the alpha male guy online. Like, um, I mean, he's he's got a lot of great points and stuff. What's up, Joe? He's got a lot of good points and things, but um, what's up, Fume? Good to Fume? see you, man. Fume? Uh, so yeah, so he, he he talks a big game, bro. He, he like he telling dudes that they need to do this and women need to be that type of way. And they, like, you know, right. some things he says he has good points on. Some things he says is just a little bit out there. But yeah. um, anyway, he's got a real big following on <laughs> social media, and uh, him and his brother like they roll around together. And you know, he's like the big face of it, but his brother he he does parts of it too. So anyway. It was in Romania, I believe, is where they got hemmed up for them charges before. Like they tried to put some charges on them, and they didn't. Oh, shit, like, okay. When the women came through, they was like, "Nah, they didn't do nothing to us," and they couldn't stick the charges to them. So they ended up getting out. Well, they were on Rumble last night. Okay. They was talking about something, man. Um, it was uh, dang it, man. I know they was talking about something about that. You know, the agenda is to like. Uh, 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 you know, get rid of any any males that aren't woke. You know what I mean? To like try to change. Like if you're not woke, if you're not a woke man, like to try to change yeah, you gotta go. or, or to do away <laughs> with you. Yeah, and um, some shit like that. I mean, I'm sure they probably talked about some other stuff too. But uh, what's up, Lonnie? Uh, but yeah. So then today they arrested him, bro. Again, I don't know what they arrested him on, but. They definitely arrested them today again, him and his brother. Where was that at? In a, in a foreign country again? I, I don't know. Out I here? I don't think so. I think it was here. I think oh, they shit. did it here. Okay. Yeah. And I, mean, I want to go see what they were saying, but they did it on Rumble, where they could talk whatever you're supposed to be. Able, you know what I mean? On Rumble, you're supposed to be. There's nothing like no, nothing to stand in the way of what you say or whatever. But Okay. 
but you know it's like i say man like a creator is only worth their reach right um his worth is pretty high in that regard like he reaches a lot of especially dudes right i mean um so yeah, bro, they they hemmed him up, man. Like I I want to look into it some more, bro. And AZ, if you in here, bro, that'd be something good for tomorrow for your for your channel, bro. Well, if it was okay. Kelly, they gotta they gotta let they gotta let him know why they why, why they got him. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Lonnie knows some Bunch, shit. What's up, they arrested Bunch? them yesterday because Aiden Ross said they were going to be leaving Romania for good while they were currently on, currently out on bond. <clears throat> That's why they arrested him. So they were trying to get get out and what? Were they supposed to stay there? I guess. Like I thought they done got cleared of them charges and stuff, man. Like I, I remember when they was going to court like a few months back. Nice. Wow. Right on, Mike. Yeah, but yeah, that's, that's crazy. crazy though. I don't know, bro. Like I need to do some research on it, man. Like I feel weird talking on stuff that I don't know. You know what I mean? Bro? Right. You want to do? Yeah. You want to know for sure certain 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 things? Yeah. Everything that's going on. Yeah. We should talk about it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, man. I mean, there's too much going on to be in the know of everything, though. You know what I mean? Like, and really, bro, I don't be on on in the internet like that. Really, like I be, I check for people that I've been some with on YouTube. I try to watch their stuff. I try to, I mean, leave comments here and there, hit the likes. But outside of that, bro, I don't do much online. So. I mean, other than like sports, like sports related things, I'd be into. Right. Yeah, that's man. Uh, <clears throat> so what? Uh, that's, that's some news right there for sure, man. Yeah, house bro. arrest it will be. We'll have to house arrest. <laughs> they was on house arrest in Romania. Sounds He's like they don't want to leave. He was out on bail, but told somebody his escape plans. No, they shouldn't be shouldn't be telling, man. Fuck, don't yeah, tell anybody any of this shit. Look at what happened to to Keefe D over there on the Tupac trial, man. He got himself in the shit because he opened his fucking mouth. Yeah, bro, that attention the motherfucker. Um, <laughs> yeah, I was hey, still. That ain't, he, he need to watch somebody else's YouTube channel. Obviously, bro, that is not gangster. Don't speak <laughs> before you act, bro. Just, just the act. Of these? Wow. That's what up, great. Rocky Strong? My peoples, my peoples. Um, Rocky, we Rocky, started bro. the episode tonight with, with a clip of you, bro. No way. Yeah, really? Uh, no, nah, I'm talking about Rock, Rocky. Oh, you? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was going to say, wait yeah, a Rocky, we started I saw the episode that was with Rocky. <laughs> if you want to meet down the middle of an aisle, <laughs> what did he say? He's like, yeah, 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 weird, right. bro. <laughs> 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 Let's play that junk again, bro. Let's do it. There's like 40, almost 50 people in here now, man. Let's give Rock some more exposure out here. No kidding, right, huh? Bro. Introducing Rocky Strong. I was like, fuck, dog. This motherfucker's definitely walking too fucking close, dog. I'm like, goddamn, bro. I almost hit him in the head with the fucking weight. He fucking swells up and walks down the aisle. Like, I gotta get out the fucking way of him. If you want to meet me, if you want to say what's up, just say what's up. First of all, you walk too close to me, right? And he just keeps on walking. I, I said it loud enough where the fucking dude could definitely hear me. And I was like, God damn, bud, I think the guy's got a crush on me. I think he's sweet on me or something, man. And don't fucking walk super close up on me, man. It's just fucking weird, dog. And nobody says, excuse me. If you square up, fucking swole up and just walk down the fucking aisle and make everybody get out your way, you're a dickhead. Now, I know you boys are probably like, man, you're probably tripping, dog. It probably wasn't that serious. You're right. It probably wasn't that serious. So you probably don't want to fucking know no better. I like to have a little bit of personal space. That's all. We're all trying to get better. You know what I'm saying? I ain't no punk, but I'll, I'll meet you halfway going down an aisle. You know, no harm, no foul, dog. You know. I ain't no punk, but I'll meet you going halfway down an aisle. I think it's sweet on me. Right? <laughs> I like that sweet on me shit. I was like, oh, fuck. Yeah, it's just fucking weird. <laughs> That's my favorite line of it all. It's just fucking weird. <laughs> hey, what's up, me? Hi, me. I like I like to give a shout out to me and me. No harm, no foul. No harm, <laughs> it's just no foul. fucking weird. <laughs> I like it, man. I like it. That's good stuff, man.
yeah. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to go through Rock more Rocky's lives, bro, and just start clipping more, bro. He's got a lot of that kind of stuff happening. I, yeah, yeah, not a good time doing it, man. I wish I could get a hold of that one that he privated. He let me see it, right? But yeah. he privated it. And he <laughs> he got out yeah. the whip, bro. He got out the whip on somebody on that one, man. So he, he was hollering like, yo, you want to do it? Like, let's get it. <laughs> he said, I don't stay in the gym for no reason, boy. Like, you want to try it? We got to test this shit out. <laughs> yeah. Test the theory, bro. <laughs> allegedly. Allegedly. Rock, bro. I got mad love for Rock. What's up, Katie Fry? <laughs> What's up, Katie Fry? <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to do that, though, bro. I, I, like, what I should do is I should go through, like, eight or ten of his lives, you know what I mean, and just take bits and pieces and yep. make him just say what I want him to say. You know <laughs> Flip I mean? it around. <laughs> yeah, like, just exactly what I want him to say. Like, like, cause you know, I mean, he be shouting me out and shit. He could be like, "Corrupt is the best YouTuber on the planet." You know what I mean? Like, he switch it around. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I should do it, man. <laughs> It'll take a lot of time and effort for for a little ass clip. though. No, that's the only thing. Excuse <laughs> me, <laughs> bro. There's been so many rock strong uh, quotes in the damn comments ever since that jank. Right. <laughs> Katie Fry says, hi, Krusty. I love your dancing. <laughs> I love you. Loving my dancing. I love you being there. Appreciate you so much. Um, thank you for coming and hanging out, you know? So crazy. <sighs> Crispy bacon. Crispy bacon's in the house. house. <laughs> I'm about to go put some bacon in right now. Sheesh. I got to stay away from the bacon. I've been eating too much lately. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Bacon is like nature's candy. <clears throat> yeah. You know what I mean? like, bacon, that's where it's at. That fucking oh. pastrami too, man. Damn. Oh, bro, I love some pastrami, man. You can talk about it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I used to hey. work in this this little town over here that's called Horsetown, USA. Hey. Um, um, Nor Norco, California. Hey. Um, <clears throat> they have like... A string of fucking different places that have bomb pastrami, and I think I, think, I ate too much pastrami out there, man. I might have clogged up some arteries or something. Oh, out there. You know. <laughs> so they're like, they're like, what do you want to have today, Chris? Um, pastrami. We had that yesterday, yeah, but not from this other joint. <laughs> you know, what yeah, I mean? right, right, right. We got to try that one. It's like being in Philly. You need every yeah. cheesesteak there is. Yeah. Hey, uh, <laughs> hey, secret time with corrupt though. Um, I got vascular disease, my guy. Thank you, Wanda. You got what? Vascular disease. Oh, okay, okay. So you you can't uh, you can't really do that. Oh, I eat all that shit, bro. What you mean? Um, you said it. <laughs> it, it, it's not my arteries this bad. It's my capillaries. My capillaries won't expand anymore. Okay. So, uh, like it, bro. For, it's till I got it all figured out, man. Like I had lost Action. feeling in my hands and my arms. For months and months, bro. Like I, like I, for real, could not reach in the dark and fly, find a light switch. You know what I mean? Like if I had um, something in my pockets, I wanted my lighter. I had to take everything out that was in my pocket and put it down to be able to. Like I couldn't feel a lighter. You know what I mean? Like oh, couldn't wow. feel anything, bro. Like it's like pins and needles. Like right, all right, all right. pins and needles. Oh, that's fucking like, crazy, bro. I mean, I figured, finally figured. Like I was getting sent all the time for um nerves and neurology. I mean, you know, right. still scanning my brain, everything, man. Like trying to figure out what it was. Come to find out, it was just my capillaries wouldn't expand, bro. It's weird. Thank you, Santa Viper. <clears throat> yeah, but I still eat all that shit. I eat whatever I want to eat, man. Yeah, I, I started tripping. doing that, and I was like, man, maybe I gotta watch that too. I'm over here because I'm, I'm having beers too, and I would I really shouldn't be having, um, so I cut it down, but. Still, you know, I'm still having it. I got to figure that out to get back to nothing again. Um, right. See, I only but, eat once a day, though. The one yeah. good eat meal a day? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, go, I go like 18 hours at a time without eating. And then I'll eat I once. See. And, you know what I mean? Intermittent fast the whole other time. So whenever I eat, bro, I eat whatever it is I want to eat. Yeah, like I've been, I've been getting them. You know, every burger joint has the the one with the the onion ring and the bacon and all that. Yeah, yeah, the Western burger, or whatever. The, the Western yeah. thing, yeah. yeah. I've been getting that, or um, just a BLT, or 
I'm like, fuck, wait a minute. I'm eating too much bacon. I'm getting too happy with this shit, you know? <laughs> see, like in the summertime, man, I'm out doing the manual labor and like it's hot out, man. Like I, I don't eat like anything except for like fruit, or maybe salad. You know what I mean? Like, That's what I was for, eating, like, yeah. I mean, because like anything else, man, I just feel too heavy, lethargic. I don't want to go back and do it anymore. Yeah, you, you want know? the light stuff but that's going to give you the energy and all the good yeah, stuff. Yeah. yeah. Which a lot of times I don't even eat. But when I do, it's like, you know what I mean, like like uh, watermelon in the middle of the day, man, when you've been working outside all day, watermelon for lunch, man. We got the little fruit stands, the big old cup of fucking everything or whatever you want. You know, what's up, West Carson? Yeah. I like that little profile pic. Which one? Wes Carson. Wes Carson? It, it stands out to me. <laughs> it, it's just bold, but you know what I mean? Black with the bold lettering. It right. just stands out. Uh, you and Rock are on diets, hitting the gym, starving, and look at those two talking about all this sinful goodies. <laughs> <To eat. laughs> yeah, they're sinful goodies, all right. <laughs> yeah, hey, I, I for real don't eat that bad though. Like the worst thing I do is drink soda. I mean the big yeah. red. That's the worst thing I do, man. Outside of that, it's it's not too bad, really. Hey, <laughs> but I, I do. I will say this, bro. I sleep eat, so like I don't ever want chocolate, nothing like that. But when, when I'm asleep. Yeah. Somehow, some way, bro, I just start craving chocolate. Like I'll get up in the middle of the night like, I need to search out and not even know I did it. You know what I mean? Like not even know. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. <clears throat> hey, 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 Rock. Um, I saw they was coming out with them pizza puff things, man. Is them things good? Pizza I puffs? heard they was good. I gotta yeah, check Domino's, that out. So they like the, a manager for fucking little Caesars, man. <laughs> have, have you had them? No, but I'm going to have them. We'll see them this weekend. <laughs> yeah, bro, they like Hot Pockets or something, man. But like, um, I mean, good, I guess. Like, It's just, it's a crust. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a pizza pot pie. If that makes sense. I and see. Like, yeah, so I see. Crust what you're is, it's all encrusted. And the inside is the pizza. Like, I mean, everything <laughs> that makes up a pizza. Very What's up, Barry? <laughs> good, huh? If I drink he it, said, what is the grape crush? Oh, say chocolate? Be, that's fire. I love those grape crushes, Will be Damn. Hey, see, that's your problem, though, Katie. You drinking the wrong stuff, man. That, <laughs> that Mountain Dew is not where it's at. <clears throat> yeah. I got to get back to my healthy shit, man. I was I was drinking carrot juice. I was drinking this and, you know, that. A big old 24 of carrot juice, you know. Oh, fuck fruit, all kinds of fruit, man. I love fruit. Yeah, yeah, fruit. Uh, the carrot juice, bro, not so much. Like the V eight juice, all that shit, man. Uh, I can't do it. Can't do it. Yeah, some of that is just a little too salty and shit. I just really, <clears throat> I'd rather have water, man. I, I should, bro. I got it. I got it so bad for caffeine, man. I buy the little water man. additive, the little squirt stuff, and yeah, uh, I get the ones that had the caffeine and the B twelve and shit in it, bro. Cause like. Caffeine and the B12 and so that shit going off out there, bro. I can't believe you don't hear that thunder, man. I saw it's you like turn up, like, like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, bro. It's like right over top of me, man. <laughs> I thought Jeez. somebody was standing in front of you, like, what's up, motherfucker? <laughs> this is gonna be an epic episode of Keep Kicking, bro. If if I just get flushed away with a tornado, man. No, like, no, 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 no. That's no, just no, like no. we going viral, cross. Oh, oh, Did you see those guys running alive and one of them just got swept away? <laughs> yeah, 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 that'd be it. That'd be like uh when 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 rock when rock we was doing rocking with Rup and we You're was right, talking about going through that backflip and uh Rock was like Rock was climbing the chair. I was like I was like, Don't do it, don't do it. Then I was like, Well, bro, if you get seriously injured, uh we might go viral, bro. They might be like, Hey, ain't that that channel where old boy became a quadriplegic? <laughs> Oh, we got we got we got a clip of that one too. We got a short of that one too. <laughs> That's good. Yeah, bring that out. <laughs> YouTube streets live after uh, keep kicking across the uh, rock, YouTube man. streets. <laughs> Look to the YouTube streets. Yeah, okay, we got started. Easy this, but I check it out every now and then. <laughs> oh, bro, I be at the YouTube streets all the time, man. Like pretty much, like even if you don't see me in the chat, man, usually I'm over there listening. You're I mean, listening like, or watching. 
Mr. Yeah, Diddy. Yeah, yeah. I'll be listening, at least listening, man. And then you know, I'll, I'll pop in the my head. <laughs> every once in a while, man. I just, uh, yeah, yeah. Because uh, it, it can get wild over there, bro. You, you got to pick your shots. No, you know, I heard. Man. You know, I'm cool, you man. Gotta, <laughs> you got to pick your opportunities over there, man. It's like dirt just set through the day. Stay away from that if you like your channel all mellow and shit. <laughs> Hey, you, yeah, you can't run in there all crazy, man, with a hatchet in your hand. You know what I mean? Like, well, yeah. ICP ass gonna get chopped down. <laughs> yeah, it's fun over there, though, bro. I, I really think y'all should bring, bring uh, Rob Does Work on more often. Shout out Rob Does Work. I know you're probably listening. You're probably I'm in the forest with a lot of people in here. Over there. <laughs> Me said a big bowl of bacon. <laughs> What's up, Vanessa? Vanessa's in the house. Happy man, Happy man and Crup. What's yeah. up, Vanessa? Happy woman? What's going on? Hopefully everybody knows that story. <laughs> Why she calls me that. I don't know, but I'm going I'm to make a rumor up. Because <laughs> uh, I'm always happy and stuff. And then uh, we share that song uh, by Chicago. Happy oh, man. You be bringing a happy vibe over there on your channel too, though. You be over there dancing, just get down, man. And it's like, yeah. hey, I understand that everybody goes through a day, and it's you know sometimes it's a hard day. So let's fucking let's boogie, let's unwind, let's talk to each other and fucking enjoy the music. That's what I do, man. You know, Every if I can help somebody day. have a you know feel a little bit better once they get home and chill and whatever, then uh, that's 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 all I need, you know. Uh, every day a hard day over here, bro. <laughs> I haven't had an easy day in I don't know how long, man. Wow, huh? It's been, it's been a long time. Yeah. yeah. I just try to I just try to keep it moving, you mean? Forever before we're never backward type of thing. Gotcha. Even though like Christina <laughs> like even though you know what I mean, I feel like sometimes there's like oh, hands that come out from the floor and like Try to grab on my shirt, pull me down, bro. I, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm just keeping moving, bro. I'm Herschel Walker with the rock, bro. I'm just so, so you, know, you know what you're describing? What's that? You're describing the duppies. The duppies? The duppies. All right, okay. tell me what that is. I read this book. I read this book by uh, Timothy White about, about Bob Marley. It's called To Catch a Fire, right? <clears throat> this was a long time ago in the early 90s. Um, so what he's describing, he's describing the, um, what do you call that? Like, like the, the folklore, the, the, the superstitions and things that, 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 that some of, some of the Jamaicans, the, the Rastas have, you know, and, um, it was believed that, that Bob Marley was born and, um, they wanted him, they wanted him since he was a baby the duppies wanted him which basically are supposed to be like like demons from the earth okay and and the and a lot of people in the folklore it is that if, if the duppies are following you you walk in a zigzag to throw them off you know there, there's a lot of crazy things but when you said you know they're reaching up out of the floor and shit, that just reminded me of the duppies that's what it feels like, bro. Like they just trying to hold me back. Like hold you back, bring you down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold. Why are you yeah, ladies white talk? I'll never stop though. I'm gonna hey shit. Whenever somebody puts a short out there and there's some bald dude walking in zigzags on it, I mean just know that's corrupt. Yeah, yeah, here trying to dodge, dipping and dodging the duppies. You know what I mean, Why are you walking that way? Shh, it's okay. Dipping the duppies. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put that in the rap song plug. <laughs> Dodging and dipping the duppies. Dodging and dipping the duppies. That's right. <laughs> I like that. That's catchy as fuck. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. <yeah. laughs> Love you, Will. You crazy bastard. I'm going to the chat. <laughs> I'm uh, stuck in my head all day. No, dodge, dodge dodge the duppies. It's probably going to kill me in Anna's later. <laughs> Right on. It's good to see you guys, man. So how was everybody else today? You guys having a good day or what? People yeah, out man, there. Guy, somebody got to be having a good day. You know what I mean? Got to have a fucking thumbs up one. Yeah, you know? Somebody somewhere, bro. There are enough people out there that somebody, I mean, at least an eighth of the people had a decent day. I mean, a decent like, yeah. day, I would call a good day at this point. So, <laughs> All is well, said so Will B. Yep, Will B. 
No, Rocky's wrong with the thumbs up, but Rocky will lie to you. Rocky will lie to you. He'll be like, man, everything was great. He just buried his dog. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fucking Rock. Do will. What? You want to do? You want to do? I do not like the damn <clears throat> this weather right now because right my nose, my man. Nose, man. <laughs> Flip, see what's up, Flip? I see you, Flip. Like so, I don't worry about nothing. La <laughs> Dodger Blue, how you doing, Cross? I'm good, brother. Good to see you, man. Good to see you, Dodger Blue. Uh, yeah, I get, I get. I get accused of not having emotions, man, because I don't, I don't worry. Like, uh, I guess what like normal people worry, like what I've been told. I just, right. I don't know, man. I don't see the point in worrying about things that have yet to happen. Like, yeah, or I don't worry just, about yeah, yeah. what is going on now, what is happening now. Now I'll plan for and try to, you know, what I mean, get ready for anything that's to happen. But I'm right. not gonna sit around. And drive myself crazy and, and ruin my mood by worrying about something that has a 20 percent chance of happening you know what i mean like to me that's just i don't know it's pointless it's a waste of energy it's a waste of time and effort so um i guess i just don't worry like normal people i've been told that normal people worry all the time they worry about everything coming but yeah they shouldn't i can't do that don't, i mean don't, worry don't will get you mind. nothing Mess up your 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 your, your peace, you know. Well, I mean, why will get you nothing, bro? You know, it's you just gotta like, worry about this. You gotta worry about this. No, I don't. Shut up. You know, like if so, it's it's the same thing for me, bro. Like if um, what's up, Mike? How about Mike. that? Um, Mike. <laughs> uh, if, so, like, if crying, if crying worked, yeah. if crying would solve the issue, that's right. Wonderful. I'd definitely be a be about crying. You know what I mean? I'd be down for it. Yeah. To me, crying is just a waste of energy. And like, I mean, there's times that like something emotional happens. You mean I might have a tear running down my cheek, but I'm not the through, type yeah. of person who's gonna sit there and like ball my eyes and like can't catch my breath type of thing. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean yeah, that's I, the only I, thing that's gonna do for me is give me a headache. They'll come down, but you're not gonna be all balling and shit. Right, 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 right. Exactly. Yeah. But like it's, it's the worry is kind of the same thing, man. Like it's just a waste of energy. Like I worry when I need to worry. <laughs> like a rocky. What do you mean? <laughs> that right, exactly, Diddy. Worrying is useless, but preparation is not. That's right. Yeah. But you don't have to be worried, Carlos. To preparate. Damn, look at my whole bear side of my house shook with that one. Mm -mm -mm. All right, all right, Vanessa. Sounds good. I'm not paranoid if everyone is after me. That's right, Roxy. Don't forget it. Show me how. What's up, Dixie? <clears throat> oh, wow. Hey, Midnight Rider. What's happening, bro? What? Yeah, you heard about the midnight. <laughs> Good to see you, Jeff. So, that's so. Dr. Disaster. I see it in my head, too. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, bro. Like once a week, man. Once a week. Once a week. Just is, is, it, is it any any particular day of the week? Nah, nah. nah. Just when there's there's time available, and like when I look at it, and the grays are starting to pop out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. Once the grays, once because you know what I mean, like them damn grays, bro. It's like they don't have to produce pigment, so they yeah. grow faster. You know what I mean? Like oh, they they okay. the grays grow longer than your hair that's still producing pigment. So like my grades will stick out a little bit rest. So it's just like, all right, it's time to go. I mean, and then I tighten up the face, all that at the same time. Yeah. At least I mean, if I don't get it within the week, bro, it's at least by the second week. Cause once my hair gets to a certain point, bro, it like it aggravates me, man. Which I used to have hair down to my shoulders, man. Um I used to rock long hair for a long time, bro. And then I ended up letting this chick shave my head, man. <laughs> <laughs> and after I let her shave my head, finally, um, I never grew hair back again, bro. I just kept shaving that giant. Like, I don't know. Like, I've, I've done, like, a bald fade, too. You know what I mean? But it, 
that takes that takes effort. Like I could just yeah. step in there and shave that motherfucker, and then might as well just do that. <laughs> after after a few days, after like three or four days, it starts looking kind of like a fade anyway. Yeah. yeah. Did you hear the new stuff that they're doing now? I seen it on fucking IG. They're tattooing like like where your hair looks right now. Oh yeah, they're yeah, tatt- yeah, yeah. Tattooing that like yeah, the, yeah, so yeah. I've seen that. I've yeah, seen so that. it can look like you're all freshly shaven and shit and whatever. <laughs> With a little yeah, bit of bro. well, I mean that's like that's the motherfuckers who be going bald too. You know what I mean? Like I got all my hair, bro. Like, that's what people that be going bald. People that are bald, man. Like I've had I've had them hate on me, man, because they like, bro, you got like I got I got nice hair, bro. If I grow it out, like it's thick. You know what I mean? Like it, it's dark, it's thick hair. But uh, it, you know, I just I can't get past that awkward stage, bro. If I could go from right here to having my hair long again, I would do it. But the, yeah, the but whole the growing it out, was, yeah, <laughs> the whole growing it out, trying to shape it and shit like that's the Especially problem. When it's right fuzzy, there. it's just like so, just not too far away from everything. Then, then it changes all my hats too, right? All my fitteds. So oh like, yeah, 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 definitely. The, then then all the, my fitteds are too small. Yeah, you know I mean? like, too tight. Yep. It. <laughs> you can uh, uh, pass yourself yeah, out. <laughs> Yeah, bro. Like they're already tight, so like when I take my fit at all, bro, I got like a line around my motherfucking head. You know what I mean? Look like I've been wearing a do rag. Like, <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Yeah, yeah. yeah head gang and don't bang. Also, the <laughs> gang, know what it is? <laughs> Damn, yeah, man. Um, I like the image. There was a there was one length that I really dug, and I want to get back to that. Um. But I'm probably gonna. I'm, I'm, well, I know I am. I'm gonna. I'm gonna shave it down again to, to what the stop cam thing is. This one right here. I don't know if you can see that, but that's that's pretty short. I think that's like a two or something, a three on top, and then the fade. I do that all myself. Yeah, I, <clears> I just got I some new bad ass clippers, bro. All my cutting, you know. As far as with the with the freaking buzzer, you know. Hey, I give you this, Hugh. Uh, you be coming through with some fucking names, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that guy, yeah, yeah, that's the one that had all these weird names. Talking about shout me out, shout me out, like, um, yeah, he's over in my doing that. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. All right. Hey, shit. See, my nose hairs don't be a problem, really, bro. Like, I got one of the things that um, yeah. it's made for your nose. Cut them up, but it's platinum wonder. Yeah, I right. hear that. I, I plug them. <laughs> you do? They're a little they make, water, they make- and, and then my, my nose will start watering. Uh, my fucking eyes will too. That's what I was about to say. Does your eyes get all water in this shit? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yep, that happens. Tattooing freckles. Wow. Yeah, they're doing that too. On top, of, on top of that stuff. You know, yeah, I, I, think, I think they're talking about like through here, like Cause some of them chicks, they like, bro. I knew this one chick. Yeah, little things. She had freckles that went across there, bro. And like, I don't know. It was like it. It, it was something that helped her somehow. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, bro. Like she had this real curly hair, and then these freckles. Like, I don't know. Was, I don't know. That's probably what he's talking about. Some of these guys that 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 uh, are bald, you know, they have to because they if they let it grow out, they got a fucking convertible top happening. You know. Like the tops down, hey, and shit, you know. There's hey, you nothing. See, uh, you nothing see, Lonnie, Lonnie talking about they do hair transplants in Turkey for cheap, right? Yeah, like you know that Adam Twenty Two cat from No Jumper that yeah. podcast. Yeah, um, that motherfucker. He been he, like he's done went two or three times and got got it transplanted. They take it yeah. on the back of your head and put it in there. Yeah, like, yeah. There's pictures of him with it and stuff. Like I don't know. I guess that shit didn't work the first one or two times. Gotta go keep going back. Wow. Yeah, bro. But that's probably why it's cheap. Because you're gonna have to pay for it for a time. Right. I fucked my eyebrows up for a few weeks ago. A few weeks ago having to let them grow out. So it's killing me. <laughs> that you was in the you was in the military. Who? Doctor Dis uh disaster. Dr. Disaster? Yeah, yeah. You watch Big Weavy Q? Big Weavy the homie. That's what he said. 
And I used to try covering my freckles. Really? Why would you cover your freckles? I, I guess to each their own, you know? I'm so far <laughs> behind in the comments, bro. Dr. Disaster out of 22 has pews on his head. <laughs> oh, man. <clears throat> I'm trying to catch up. Yeah, I'm just right here. So um, you can die from plucking the nose hairs, bro. Who said that? <laughs> Doctor Disaster said it. You gonna die? You can die from plugging your nose, bro. You gonna give yourself a heart attack? You are gonna be like old boy on the on the football field, man? Well, then I'm living dangerously. Yeah, <laughs> boy. Every time he's in the damn bathroom sink, he's living on the edge, boy. I'm on the fucking edge. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> Adam Twenty Two has pubes on his head, bro. That's what you're saying. That's what you're saying. Yeah. <laughs> And then maybe hey, cover her freckles. <laughs> you tried to cover your freckles, and now people's out there spending money to get them. Right, for real, I got I got some freckles though, for real. Yeah, I think I seen that in in some of the things uh, that you got out there. Yeah, um, it could be skin cancer, but we gonna call this freckles. You know what I mean? Oh, freckles. Um, nah, but I do. When I was a kid. When I was a kid, I had freckles, bro. Like, I didn't I really. I, I never had them. But when when I was a kid, bro, I had freckles, like pretty pretty good. But then once I I got older, they went away. You know, it kind of faded out. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But like, I got weird ass scars on my face, man. Like, I got a scar under my eyeball. I have no idea where that bitch came from. I got I got a scar in the middle of my head. I can't remember really? where that came from. I got. A you don't remember where that came from head. either. Damn. I mean, I remember one one that goes sideways right there. I got cut. Yeah, but I don't remember where the big one come from. <laughs> uh, I remember where the eyebrow got split. I remember where the where the one right next to the eyebrow came from. Yeah, when yeah. I when, when I cut my hair long, I mean, I mean short and, and do the you know the all, all short whatever. Then, then you'll see the battle scars on my head. <laughs> see, fucking not. There's a scar there. There's a there's a stitches back here. There's all kinds of little things that, that'll pop up once it gets really short. <laughs> yeah. Hey man, when I was a kid, we would uh we had this band though that we hung out at and shit. And um we would go and always be tearing shit up, you know, just being bad little kids, man. And so one day we had tore a bunch of damn shingles off the roof, man. And we was out there sidearm, you know, it's shoo, 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 shoo. they was just flying, bro. And then um, me and one of my homies was still standing over there, and we was in the field with all these shingles at that point behind the gas station in between the bando right there in the cut. And yeah. um, then my one homie, he had to go home, so he took off walking away walking away from us. Yeah. And my other homie, bro, was standing there with a shingle, and he wasn't thinking nothing about it, man. He tried to hit him off. He, he tried to hit him off. a shingle, you know what I mean? Yeah. And all of a sudden, he throws the shingle, bro. And homeboy yells, grabs his head, and falls to the ground, right? We oh. run up on him, bro. This shingle oh. is impaled into his skin, bro. It oh. sliced him open, oh. and shingle stuck inside of the flap, bro. Like, oh, uh, man. gosh, man, we was probably like 10 years old, bro. Oh. <laughs> uh, it was maybe 11, you know what I mean? But, like, that shit oh, was crazy. Yeah. I mean, like, the homeboy had to go explain how he got the down shingle in his head because they took him to the hospital and they found all the little granules off the, yeah, off the yeah, shingle yeah. inside his head. You know I mean? Like, yeah, we done yeah. pulled the shingle out. So he went home with no shingle in his head. But, oh, but he, he had, had to explain. All the, all the, yeah. all the pains, like you said, yeah. So then, you know what I mean, his parents started calling our parents. And, you know what I mean? And all hell broke loose from there. But, yeah, his head was fucked up ever more after that, bro. Oh, <laughs> I, I mean, I, there's a lot of. I saw somebody put it in the chat earlier, man. Like, not everybody looks good with a bald head. You know what I mean, right? That's true. You have to have a certain shaped head. Yeah. You know, I got that, a little bitty, little bitty me. ass pea head, bro. You know what I mean? So, in the early '90s, um, my brother and his friend Eddie, they were fucking sitting there trying to tell me, "Hey, cross shave your shave your head, shave your head. You know, get a fade, this and that." And I was, I, I at that point, I, I was, I was trying to, you know. Uh, do whatever. I, I used to have that flap 
You know, all that right here was all long, and they just fucking kind of pull it back and shit. Yeah. I used to have that for a while, and they were like, "Come on, we'll do it for you. This and that. You look good. You look like you have the right shape head." And they did it. And they were like, "Yeah, yeah, all right." And I was like, "Yeah, it looks all right, cool." Hey, but getting back to that shingles shit, you just sparked something right there, man. I got a story about shingles. I I got one after you. Go ahead. Um. Uh, uh, fuck. I was I was I was edging. I was uh, I was. Older than 25 be before 30, somewhere up in there. I forget what it was. And I got drunk. And um, I was hanging out, you know, on Bonnie Beach and the, and the pads and shit. There's two houses on, on, on the property. And, you know, my dad lives in the front. And my grandparents and me live in the rear. And the rear house is the biggest house. Um, anyway, I got up on my dad's house, which is up in the front. And, you know, I was standing in front right there looking at the whole neighborhood, like, what's up with everybody? See what's going on and shit. And um, I was kicking it there for a while. Well, the roof was already falling apart, so I fucking started plucking off shingles and chucking them. Right? I'm seeing what I could hit or whatever. And um, at one point, I fucking chucked the, sh the shingle. I didn't see a cop car coming down, and it fucking hit the roof of the cop car. Bam, and it sounded loud. I was like, oh, fuck. So I went around to the side of the, the roof where you couldn't really see me. Nah, man, these motherfuckers hit reverse. They, came, they got on. They, you know, they, they saw me on the roof. They said, get your ass down here. I was like, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. You know, um, but I'm, I'm, I'm drinking on my own property. You know, what the fuck are you going to do? Anyway, they came on, and they started talking crap to me. How old are you? This is that and da-da-da. I was like, oh, fuck. And then my grandmother came out. And she was like, what's going on? And, and fucking, that was the most embarrassing thing. You know, in front of her grandmother, she's, they're like, well, he's over here, blah, blah. And I was like, oh, all bad, man, all bad. Um, <laughs> ruined it all. I had a nice high going and shit. And then, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> it was all bad. Well, even still, bro, they would have to prove that you threw it. Right, you know? right, right. There's no proof you threw that. Yeah. Um, but I must have hit it good because I heard that fucker just blam. I was like, oh fuck. <laughs> hey, this this comment where we I was talking about shingles and then you did and me put I heard shingles sucks. Um no lie, bro. 28 years old, I got shingles. Oh, right. really? The shingles shingles. Yeah, the shingles shingles, bro. Like how is that? that does suck, bro. That bar, that 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 yeah. sucks sucks? sucks? Yeah, bro. So look, I gotten I mean, this is back in the times when I used to buy a bunch of scripts of uh, like Roxy 30s and Methadone 10s, and I just go crazy, right? You're spending five grand a month on pills and stuff. And um, so my my girl, she had a, a friend who was getting married in South Carolina. So we go from Indiana, and like, mind you, um, I forget when they got married, but uh, it was only like, I don't know, three months or so after we had my last, my my, my youngest child. Okay. And so, yeah, well, it was the, it was right in like, the, it, it was right before Halloween when they was getting married in November. So we go down there and I'm, I'm sniffing Roxy 30s the whole way, bro. Just, boom, just getting messed up like the whole way there, bro. I yeah. get down there, you know I mean, everything's cool. Like I made good time getting down there. Like everything's great. I get to um, the day before the wedding. I done sniffed up everything I brought with me, bro. Like, I'm out. And so now I'm about to go through withdrawals, right? Yeah. And so I'm going to start going through withdrawals all day that day. But I just live with it, deal with it. And then I was like, okay, the next day, the day of the wedding, I was like, I can't be all horrible today. And I had brought a suboxone strip with me, bro, just in case something just like this case. happened. And, yeah. Uh, so, I mean, because, you know, when you're living like that, bro, you got to be prepared, like. I couldn't just run out of opiates. I'd be dead, damn near. So I had that Sobo, man. I popped that thing and went straight back up because I didn't take Sobos back then, really. And um, so anyway, uh, we get done with the wedding and everything. We start headed home. Now, I'm only on the Sobo. Like, this is the day after the wedding. And the Sobo isn't, like, the second day of taking the Sobo isn't efficient like it was the first day. And so, okay. and also, I'm, I'm I'm racing trying to get home, man, from South Carolina to Indiana because yeah. I want to take my my youngest, my, my last born child. I want to take her onto her first Halloween trick or treat stuff with my older daughter. You know what I mean? 
Yeah. And, I mean, I had they, she had ants that would do it, but I didn't want them to do it. I wanted to do it. And because when I was a kid, bro, I wasn't allowed to trick or treat. Like, I never went trick or treating in my lifetime until I took my son. And, yeah. Uh, so I'm racing, bro. And like my whole time, my back is itching. And I'm just, I'm, I'm driving, but I'm tearing it up, man. You know, scratching, scratching it. Fuck I mean, yeah. she had these nails. So I'm like, yo, scratch my back, will you? And so she's like, I mean, scratch that thing till it's raw, pretty much, man. And the whole All time right. she calling me a pussy, telling me that, you know what I mean, I'm being a pussy, like, you know what I mean, it ain't nothing but your back itching, da, da, da. And we get there, bro, we go trick-or-treating, you know what I mean? It was nice in South Carolina. We get back here, it's all, like, snow, wet, icy stuff. It's horrible. Um, but I made it just in time, take her trick-or-treating. The next morning, bro, I wake up, and it's all broke out back there where, where it's itching. And what and it has started itching on my side, and I had started itching it there too, bro. And um, I didn't have insurance, nothing at the time. You know what I mean? Like I was still living reckless, and uh, I hadn't got none of my shit together. And uh, so I didn't go to the hospital, bro. My my girl actually like treated me. She she did some research and shit, and then she went and got these certain little bandages, the ones that like do the self healing. You leave them on there for like four, five, six days, and they do self-healing and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. But she wasn't leaving them on there. She'd leave them on there for like a day, take it off, clean it, put a new one of them on. And like um, and about a week, bro, uh, maybe longer. I don't know. It's been a long time ago. It's been, I mean, let's see, it's been 12 years ago. So, yeah, it was um, it was bad. Did you so ever go to the doctor? Did they ever tell you yeah. why you had it and you got it so early in life? I mean, they, they say that stress can do it. Um, but you know, you have to have had the chicken pox when you was a kid. Right, you right. You had right. the chicken pox, then you could have it any point yeah. in your life. You could have shingles. Um, but like stress stress induced can can cause it to come on quicker because a lot of times people don't get them till they older, you know what I mean? Um, yeah. a lot of older people get the shingles. But like ever at twenty eight years old, man, but you know, I was on a lot of opiates, bro, and came down in one day from a lot and then you know, went back on some shit that <laughs> blocks the opiates, but hits the receptors, and you know, like I, I did that pretty quickly uh, in comparison to how long you're supposed to take in between, and right. uh, and so yeah, man, it was uh, it was the whole time, bro. Like, what's up, pup? Uh, it was it was it was horrible, bro. It was horrible. Like, <laughs> I wouldn't wish that shingle shit on nobody, man. Like. Right. But I'm sure, I'm sure all the drugs and the stress of trying to get home in time for all that, like I'm sure it played a part in it. Yeah. Up too. Yeah, my dad got that. He said it wasn't his joke. He said he took the medication and stuff, and then went away. Uh, Katie, I, I, um, I, I washed my mine too. I washed my damn stizzy. It still works. Um, I tried it too. I, I figured I would dry it, but I threw away the damn, the damn cartridge because um. You know, who knows, water got in there or whatever, but um, <clears throat> the the actual battery still worked. So you might you might have got lucky. I would suggest maybe dry it, <laughs> leave it in the clothes and dry it too. <laughs> I got mad as fuck, right? So I had this um, I had this little disposable um, vape that I had gotten a while back, man. And it'd been chilling like I used it when I first got it. But then I hadn't used it in a while. And then I hit it a few times the other day. Yeah. And the thing was cool. And then it went dead. But I mean, like, it's brand new. But it's right, right. Dead. It's, it's one of them cheaper ones from back when. So, I mean, maybe it's because of how long it's been sitting around. But um, there's no way to charge it, you know what I mean? I just busted that bitch open, took the guts out, bro, grabbed the battery. And hooked it in, take the cables and just put them on both ends of the battery, man. That thing hit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, it worked. <laughs> it's called a million pieces. Story about I mean, you look like a red heart. Turns out, wow. I mean, you know, things happen, bro. Damn. Oh hell no, that's crazy. Yeah, I've had the, the chicken pox, so hopefully I don't get them. They say it misses certain people. <laughs> Adventures are crusty. All right, Puffy. Why is it lost? Mary Banana Split. No, oh, this is a great lost Mary. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Adventures. 
Later, later adventures of Crusty. Oh my god, I have lost many strawberry peanuts. What the hell? Right on. Looks like a soiree now. <laughs> wow. A oh, square. Okay. <laughs> I was I about to say, damn! I never knew. I never knew Anna to use the word soiree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's, that's, that's a good word. Good <laughs> word. Yeah, it's expanding the vocabulary. Is the YouTube streets live already, or is they going live? I have not I seen like any uh any uh notifications. I, I am I slow. Note. Oh yeah, they notification. are. And that's it. Yes, it's all right. Yeah, they are live. They're live right now. Yeah, mm -hmm. I said he was gonna go live. Yeah, they just went well, live. We just hit an hour, bro. <clears throat> well, we did. Yeah, nice. we just hit an hour. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, the, the person that just texted me right now, um, Krupp's got the controls. I don't have the controls. What's up? <sighs> Drop that thing. Drop what? The link? So you got a bike. A motorcycle? No, I don't. I used to. Wait. I used to. Where do you see this shit at, bro? I don't even see it. I used to ride my motorcycle. Just send a message on YouTube. Said service is available. Can you guys see me? I can see you, yeah. Yeah, I, I can see you. I can even finish it off. Oh, shit. Mm, you must be jumping around in the comments, bro. I keep trying to see what you're reading, and I'm like, "What the fuck did you see that, man?" I'm reading whatever's whatever's on the on the streamyard feed. I know I don't have it. <laughs> I don't know, man. Oh. It's in the URL. Damn it. Damn, son. I'm telling you, bro, that shit is no joke out there, man. It's no joke. Like, the whole time I've been in here, bro, it sounds like the walls is being beat in. I cannot believe you can't hear it, bro. I can't hear it. That's why I'm making tornado jokes and shit, man, right? because I feel like they're going to be one bust through the door anytime. It's that bad, huh? It's crazy out there, man. I know. Anna said she took a shower uh, just in case it came. Yeah. Got a doctor's appointment tomorrow. Yeah, bro. I gotta get up early too. I gotta take um I gotta go go. I gotta go shit further than you do, and I gotta go to Jeffersonville tomorrow, man. I gotta take the girls to the orthodontist tomorrow morning. Um and I just took a shower right before this, so I'm 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 gonna step ahead. <laughs> Blow up my microwave. Who is you talking to? <laughs> you talking to Will B? Who is you talking to? How, how long are you trying to go with this tonight? Shit, that don't matter, bro. Okay, no, because you yeah, said you have stuff to do and you got to get pretty. I, you know, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to um, fuck up any of that. Hey, uh, I'm going to drop this real quick. Somebody nah, wants to come. Uh, it's whatever, bro. I mean, like, even if I get off here now, I'm probably not going to go straight to bed. I'm going to go see what they're doing at the YouTube streets. And right. Go from there. But right, 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 right. It don't matter to me, man. Um, it's, it's like 11.45 over here right now. Right. Oh, yeah, I can't that do that. too bad for me. It's in the URL. <clears throat> So we go. Yeah, if I can't, uh, I'll do it another day. Right on. Yeah, we could do that another day. I'm just having fun joking with the wheel. <laughs> I will be eight pay for twenty four bucks for vape for elf. What the hell? Say bless. What's it right on, Jojo? We'll see you, bro. Can you fucked up for twelve hundred dollar vape? Damn, twelve hundred bucks. Jesus. Damn, what does it do? <laughs> what the hell you mean? 
Wow. That's crazy. I need some more tissue, damn it. Fucking nose. I'll change you. <laughs> I'll change your noses. I'm gonna hop off. Here, 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 right now. Right on. Damn. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna mute it real quick. Alright. You good, brother. You good. Gotta hop off. Hivering. Hivering. <laughs> okay. Mustard ain't worth a hundred bucks combined. We'll be. All right, Wanda, take it easy. Have a good evening. We'll see you, Wanda. See you evening. Good to see you. Hell yeah! Wow. Oh, I made the whole screen freeze up for a minute, bro. Um, what is the what? My whole freeze. My whole, uh, my whole screen froze up. My whole oh, screen froze up. Do you think that could be the weather outside? <laughs> uh, I think it's probably more to do with all the damn shit I got on this phone, bro. Uh, I, I do every everything I do, I do on this phone. You know? You're on the phone, like, wow. Yeah, right now, anyway. But, yeah, everything I do, so any editing, any any graphics, any you know, anything, bro. Anything I do, I do from here. That's pretty cool because you could do because like the phone is is a little more versatile. I mean, you could take it wherever you want, and you know you could be sitting somewhere and I could do it either way. You know. Yeah, I mean, and I mean, I'm I'm used to working with it. Like I tried to work on a computer, and it, like it's gonna take me some time to get used to that. Like, um, <clears throat> but at the same time, my phone don't have enough space to keep everything I've done. And to continue doing, you know what I mean. So like at some point, I gotta, I gotta start erasing it because like I'm not gonna erase the stuff with my children, right? I'm gonna erase my original videos and stuff before I erase the stuff with my children. Yeah. So now in case she coming for you, Bill. That's that's it. Target confirmed. His name is Will B, aka Motor Mouth. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> That's it right yeah. there. Will B has got it now. He's going to get it. <laughs> Damn. What you want to do, man? You want to push this thing to my midnight, which is like nine minutes? Whatever you want, bro. Whatever you want. I know we fucked up. Um, I fucked up. I know. Um, in here a little later. Um, I wasn't ready either, bro. That's the thing. Right. It wasn't just you. Like, I was over here trying to put my light back together, man. Right. Right. Yeah. I hear you. Yeah, I just got caught up. I was like, oh, fuck. And then when I got here even more, I was like, damn. And it'll be 40 minutes later. It's like, you know, hey, people still roll through, bro. We had like 50, 50 something in here at one point. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice. That's yeah, fucking people cool. still roll through. So, them numbers, them numbers are probably stay consistent of what they've been like the last couple Thursdays. And we keep on discussing stuff to talk about, but then we don't even talk about it. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was something like, um, like uh, what did I say earlier? Um, or stories from work, you know? Crazy stories. There's yeah, always, yeah, yeah. There's I always. got a story for you, bro. What's up, Mark? I got a story for you because you was talking about times um, about getting beat up or whatever, right? Like when we was young. Yeah. Like something like that. You said something like that. It made me think of a story. Like I don't know. I don't know if like I didn't really get beat up, but okay. it was about to turn ugly, right? So I had this chick, and I mean I'm probably like. Uh, probably like 13 years old, man. What's up, Tashanka? And, and um, this chick has her birthday coming up. Well, okay. this chick also, like, she's, she's, she's like a friend of mine. Like, okay, so, like, I dated her at one point, right? Yeah. But 
but it was never like serious date. Like I never really did nothing with her. Like you know I mean, like we dated when we, we was young. It wasn't like crazy, nothing crazy, right? right. And, and like we done moved on from that. Like she was, she was like a homie to me, and um, like a real, a real friend. And so and she lived right on the corner of my street. So okay. she invites me to her birthday party, and she, they're going to this place. Uh, one of them, one of the water parks that has the, the fake waves and stuff. You know what I mean? Like, okay, okay. The waves going to one of them, bro. And I'm like, yeah, 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 I'll come, you know. And then uh, she had this little boyfriend at the time, and she okay. asked him to come too. And that was supposed to be the only two dudes, but dude was like, I don't know what was up with him, him, bro. He was like, he he wasn't going unless he could take his little homeboy with him. So they was like, all right, cool, take your homeboy. I mean, me, I'm like, fuck it, bro. I rode solo, like. Yeah, yeah. it was nothing but chicks. Yeah. It was this yeah. other girl that was going that I was trying to mess with. It was another a few other girls that was cute. You know what I mean? I was like, hey, I'm going regardless. Like, I'm going. Right. And so I went. And then at one point, man, um, the chick that it was my friend that lived on the corner with the waves is going and stuff. I'm 15 feet away from her, bro. And uh out of nowhere, man, I look over and she like grabs across her chest, right? And her bathing suit top goes floating. Now her boyfriend, he ain't in the area. Like he's okay. somewhere up, up somewhere at the table somewhere. Yeah. Her boyfriend's little buddy that came with it, he was right there next to her. Like he probably did that shit. Like, but yeah. he goes, he goes and tells her boyfriend that I did it, that I undid her top. Uh, Ooh, come on. Bro, I didn't do it. If I did it, I would tell you I did it. Like hey, I yeah, did I'm not do it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like I was not even close to it. So, um, at one point, at short, like, I don't know that he went and told him this. I don't know nothing about it till later. But at, at some point, her little boyfriend comes up to me, and this is a dude. Like he was a skinny little dude, man. But he wore he like he's a dude that wore a, a, a t-shirt at the swimming pool. You know what I mean? Oh, like, but he wasn't yeah. fat. He wasn't right. one of the fat boys wearing a swimming shirt. He just he wore a swimming shirt, right. and so and so, you know, automatically I think something right like that 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 tells me something in character right there at the gate. But so he comes up to me, bro. And he's talking about, hey man, you want to wrestle? You want to wrestle in the pool? You know what I mean? There's people everywhere, bro. There's lifeguards. Like you get thrown out for that shit. And I mean, and plus when I was a little kid, like I, I pretty much drowned. And my sister, she did drown all the way. She was carrying oh. me on her shoulders. You know, the slopes in the pool where it goes from the shallow to the deep. She yeah. hit that, slid down. I couldn't swim at the time. My legs is locked up around her arms. I'm trying to get, you know what I mean, trying to get to the top. Away, yeah. the time, she getting kicked to the bottom. You know what I mean? By the time they get, got both of us out of there, bro, she was purple. You know what I mean? Like oh, CPR, bro. all that man. Uh So, like, bro, I ain't trying to, I ain't trying to, you know what I mean, wrestle in this pool, bro. What you mean? And so... He came back another time, bro, trying to trying to like coax me into wrestling. I'm like, nah, nah, bro. Like, if you want to wrestle, we can go wrestle out there. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, I'm not wrestling you in the pool, no. Yeah. And so then another time, he comes over to me, and that's when I hear about undoing the top. He was like, "So you undid my girlfriend's uh, bathing suit, huh?" I'm like, the fuck, you was talking about? Yeah. He puts he he makes a fist with one hand. And he opened, like, I've stole this move after this in life, bro. I, I did this to several people afterwards because when he did it to me, it pissed me the fuck off. So right. I was like, yeah, I'm going to do that to somebody. But he put a fist on one side of my face and his hand on the other and just pushed like that. You know what I mean? Like, it, yeah. he didn't hit me, but he pushed me. And right. we in the water, you know what I mean? So there's not a whole lot of, you know what I mean? So as soon as he did that, bro, I just I just smoked him. You know what I mean? Like, That's because it pissed me off so bad, I didn't even think about it, bro. I just, bam, drew through him. And then um, he ended up catching me. He caught me, like, right on the cheekbone, which did a good little bit of damage, right? Like, it swelled my, it swelled, it, hurt, it didn't yeah. swell my eye shut or nothing. But it, I mean, it gave me, like, a damn black eye right there. And, right. uh, but then, bro, I just badgered him then, you know what I mean? Like, I, I ended up smashing him in the nose and, I broke his nose, this shit leaking, you know what I mean? Like, he ended up looking pretty bad out of it. And my shit kept swelling, though, bro, like, after it was over. But, like, all of a sudden, bro, these lifeguards, I hear whistles. They start diving in, you know what I mean? They're breaking it up. They're pulling me. I, there's this one big-ass lifeguard. He's pulling me by my waist up and out the pool, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. And then um, they telling me, they telling me that I'm out of here and that he's out of here and blah, blah, blah. And then all these little chicks, man, that went with us, they all start running up there talking about, 
yo, 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 he didn't do it. He didn't do it. Like he, he came and started it with him. He was just, uh, protecting himself. You know what I mean? And so like they end up throwing the little punk ass motherfucker out the pool and yeah. out, out. I mean, he had to wait outside yeah. or whatever, wherever the fuck he went. They let yeah. me go sit down for like 15 minutes. And then the whole time the girl I was trying to kick it with, the main reason why I went to that thing, she sat over there and kicked it with me while I had, you know, I mean, had the little time out. Yeah. Whatever. So it, it was a win win, right? Yeah. Well, homeboy is not happy about how that outcome in that pool came out. So, um, and I don't know, man. I think, I think, I mean, I think it's over and done. Like, I just, I just beat your face in, bro. Like, yeah. I mean, you got me one good time uh, in the early, in the early throws. Like, mm, rem- I mean, bro, the waves was coming as we throwing fists. You know what I mean? Them right. generating waves was coming. Like, it was hard as fuck to fight in that shit, man. And so, I mean, you just throwing, like, um, but yeah, he got me one good time, but I, I beat him up, really. And then we get to her house. Everybody, you know what I mean? It was two carloads of people. We get to her house, and uh, out of nowhere, bro, this dude that used to be my dog, right? Like, but he and I, we, we, we had beef over several different girls, too. So yeah. this dude had done made like three different phone calls, bro. And like out of nowhere, man, there's two vehicles that pull up and like there's a, there's two guys, each one of them. But that that was right after my homie, my homie that was the homie. He showed up first because he lived right there in our neighborhood and he showed up first. He came down through there, bro. And like they tried starting shit with me again right there in old girl's front yard. So I ended up like old boy started charging me, bro. I picked him up with my shoulder and just launched his ass into the bushes next to the house. You know what I mean? And then right. uh, I ended up like they didn't they didn't approach me no more. So I started walking away. I got I got about I don't know half a block away, bro. And then these vehicles rolled up on me, boom, boom. And there's about four guys dressed. And now there's like seven dudes, bro. And just fun. me. And like I ain't got nobody to call, nothing. You know what I mean? Like, uh, and so I'm like, fuck, bro, this is about to end bad. And you know what I mean? The guys that was driving, I'm 13. The guys that's driving 16 and 17. You know what I mean? Like right. they way bigger than me, all that shit. Yeah. Like, I ain't got nothing on me, bro. All of a sudden, bro, I hear this damn sound, right? And it's it's a uh, it's like aluminum being, you know, I me mean, hitting blacktop. And but it's just being drug. It's <laughs> and uh homie. It's my it's my sister, my the second child. My sister, bro, come out there and ride with me, man. And she brought <laughs> there, uh, she brought two baseball bats, bro. And so she came up there with a baseball bat, stood right next to me, handed me the other baseball bat, and was like, "Shit, let's do it, uh, bro." I love my sister to death for that. You know what I mean? Like home, both of the all the both of them dudes' oh, yeah. cars got filled up and they cut yeah. out. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, like we ended up getting into some other shit later on. But that night, bro, I thought I was for sure gonna end up pretty beat up. And you know what I mean? My sister came through, right? And I don't, you know what I mean? Like, they could have easily beat both both of my sister and I. Look, it wasn't like that changed the damn game. I mean, we had baseball bats, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that helped. But uh, they still could have got us, you know what I mean? Like, I'm pretty sure they still could have got us. My sister was a little devil, though. I will, you know what I mean? Like, her and I, we, we, she fought me my whole life, bro. So, <laughs> up until, up until one time, she pissed me off in front of this girl. How come everything got to do with a, with a damn girl, bro? Yeah, uh, yeah. She pissed me off in front of this girl one time, man. Like, trying to, trying to, like, uh, pick on me and make me look, you know what I mean? Foolish and shit. And, like she, when I was young, bro, she used to beat my ass. You know what I mean? She always had these fingernails, bro. She was scratched the fuck. That's One time she scratched straight through my eyeball with them motherfuckers, man. But um, damn, she had said some shit, bro, and like it just like in front of that girl, what she said, like it all just all the variables matched up to be, you know I mean a real problem. And I remember I was on the basketball court, but the basketball court was concrete, and uh, I ended up picking her up on my shoulder, and I just. I slammed it down, bro. Not even yeah. thinking, you know what I mean? I just picked up, threw it down. When I threw it down, she hit that concrete and she just laid there, bro, and cried like I felt so bad, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, she she told my pops and then I got my ass beat for real, for real. But for real, that was real. the last time she ever like, did anything physical to me. But yeah, man, it always starts with the girl. <laughs> Katie, <laughs> damn, they got a car, they got another car chase in LA right now. 
I followed this um this fucking channel. It's called Live Police Chases in LA. Yeah, yeah, that, that should be happening all the time. They got that shit on right now. <laughs> yeah, bro, that should be happening all the time. What's up, Dominique? Good to see you, bro. Probably, What's probably up? gonna wrap it up, man. Really, but yeah, I'm glad you came through, huh? Yeah, 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 that yeah. that 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 little story though, it took me back, bro. Like I ain't thought about this shit in a minute. Yeah, you know I mean? like that's a fighting crazy. that dude in that in them damn generator ways, bro. That shit was funny. <laughs> Puffy with her bun, she said, "That's why I have a bun ready to go." <laughs> that's that's born bun ready, born bun ready, boy. Yeah, shit pops out, boom, put in a bun, let's go. <laughs> Hell yeah. Damn. That's what you just do the Britney Spears and shave your whole head, you know what I mean? You don't gotta worry about it. Wow, fucking Britney. So what happened to that, right? JVM Centenario. What the fuck? What's up, man? I street box. <laughs> yeah, she like that Street Fighter girl. She put the hair up in the two little buns, bro. Be like, uh, what's her name, Chung Lee or whatever? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see that. Damn it! Oh, I need another fucking tissue. Oh, duh. Chung Lee. <laughs> oh, shit, shit, bro. I said take it to midnight. It's twelve o five. I got all uh into telling down swimming fighting story. Hey, uh, I can still see that shit. You know what I mean? It's one of them stories. Like I can see it, play by play in my head still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I, I couldn't believe you. that homeboy done turned on me. The dude, the dude from my neighborhood. You know what I mean? I couldn't believe he showed up because he was older than me too, and so he showed up trying to fight me. Bro, I could not believe you know, it. Let him a, a sour story. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I mean, he already. You know I mean, he already, like we. I mean, bro, it, that was like uh I don't, I don't really be having frenemies. You know, people say frenemies, but I guess, I mean, he was probably like my first, I don't know, maybe my second frenemy. Because it was always like, bro, we, we would be cool, and then some little bullshit would happen, and then it was like, you know what I mean, we're ready to fight. And then we, we, we hate each other. And then we fight every time we see each other. Then we be cool. You know? Wow. <laughs> she got bad from everything. <laughs> Me and Puffy will protect you. Uh, I guess um, me wanted to get on and say something. Who that? Uh, me. Uh, I don't know if you want to drop the link for her. I dropped the link for her. Before I run off on you, shit, I could, I could leave it going even if you wanted. And oh, I'll I do leave shit to do too, real quick. Oh, uh, I'm gonna put my nose. Oh, you said me, not B. I was like, who is B? No, like B, like the letter B. That's my fucking nose right there. <laughs> yeah, 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 that part. <laughs> Okay, cool. Hey, I went to jail for underage drinking, okay? Illegal consumption, public intoxication. Yeah. <laughs> jail for that dumb He's shit. He's talking about you. you and off girls, too. <laughs> I can't win, bro. Every damn story tonight involves a girl. Yeah, well, um, that, that'll happen. <laughs> <laughs> messing with girls <laughs> uh, yeah I mean it was all different girls but yeah yeah it was a problem once upon a time I'm going to have to get going I got to get up early tomorrow all right Tashoka all right Mark hey appreciate you coming through sir girls just want to have fun but dudes just want to be a problem <laughs> that part <laughs> Man, hey, thanks for muting the phone. I didn't mute nothing. This is not this via Hito again. <laughs> What's up, Kutura? Oh, Did you watch this from the seniors' home, Kutura? 
<laughs> oh shit, dude. check it out. Now we got sparks flying. What's the major problem? Oh jeez. <laughs> they don't care, man. They just care. oh, they he stopped. Oh shit, they're gonna they're gonna round him up right now. That's it. He stopped. It done, bro. On the freeway all the time, man. These guys. I swear. Yeah. you miss me. <laughs> Damn. Well, Megan. No. Okay. The drop. The link was dropped, Megan. Uh, is is she in your chat though? Because she won't be able to see it if she's in my chat. Um. Oh, you'd yeah, have she, to copy. You'd have to copy she, it yeah. and put it in your yeah, chat. Yes, she is. She's a mind. Oh, well, she could just go over there. Go over to Krupp. Yeah, it's in his chat. Go over to Krupp. K R U P. Just look it up. It's very simple to get to him because nobody really has that name out there. Yeah, well, it's I T Z K R U P. It's Krupp. What's up, Spanx? I see you, brother. He's grew up. Yep, yep, that yep. guy that sound like DMX. <laughs> sound like DM, D, DMX. The country, the country DMX. <laughs> oh, jeez, Kenny. What the fuck did this guy do? Is is me still in here? I think he ate shit. What does that look like? That's the front of the car. That don't look. That looks like it ain't. He ain't shit, huh? Yeah, he in the. He, yeah, he he laying down, ain't. Eh? So, something. So, I don't know. It looks. This just looks weird. Fuck. Hey, hey, good look, man. I'll drop it over there. Yeah, he hit something. Yeah. Fucking guy. To be fucking around with those cars, man. <laughs> you guys <laughs> fucking around with them police, yeah, man. Yeah. Hold you up. Well, what was it that you wanted, man? Nigga. Nigga. Hit that link. All right, puff it straight yeah. up. I do like Paula Abdul. Straight up. Straight up now. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Megan. 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 Good evening, Megan. What's up, Megan? Hey, guys. How are you? We're good. We're here. I didn't really have anything uh, important to ask. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. Do I have a delay? Yeah, you do it a little bit. Right, right, right. There you are. <laughs> Hello, Megan. Um, that, that is me. Damn, I do have a delay. Okay, okay. I'll put my son. I'm why. My fault. Sorry, I have a pretty major program. I like the background, though. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah she's oh, just... <laughs> All right. It was good to meet you, Megan. Possibly. Yeah, that's me. She's cool. Uh, she uh, oh, she, she my and it uh, helps out every now and then. They pro out some. I said she comes over on my channel and helps out every now and then. Damn. I don't think I've been up on your panel in a long time. It's been a while. Uh. The last time was when you try to keep up with the music, uh, the, the the requests. Yeah, but I was up there working, not having fun. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, it was people, still fun. People did not follow directions. <laughs> oh, that was just, yeah, it was, it was not easy. I never do. She does art too, Puffy? Right on. Get down. I did this what backdrop. What kind of do you do? Um... I do computer art, but on top of that, I do like a, what are they called? Um, abstract, poor art. Mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. kind of, I don't really have any handy right here. Oh, yeah, I do. <laughs> you still think she took your cat? 
<laughs> Do they really? Hey, you, you so puffed the kid, cat. That's horrible. Are you the cat, Robert? <laughs> my cat looks like a looks like their cat, and so when her daughter saw my cat on the computer, she's like, "She took her cat." Oh shit! <laughs> and she, no, she keeps thinking that. That's crazy. You did. You did find me dirty weather. What's dirty happening, weather. brother? <laughs> I saw you subbed up the other day, man. I appreciate that. I truly do. Uh, oh, dirty weather. I uh, said I was like, man. I've been I've been going in this for like thirty minutes now. We just keep, we just keep going. It's a crab. Okay. So no, you guys can go. I just I just um I wanted to come up, but I don't know. So I thought I'd go to the bar. Oh, oh yeah. shit! To the bar. You starting Yo. the weekend early, huh? No, I just haven't been out all week. <laughs> <laughs> you go have a couple, have a what couple, do? then chill out. I don't know. I haven't hey, I, gone out since, uh, let's see, like last yeah, week is when I broke up with the boyfriend. So I haven't been out and it's right. Ramadan. So he's not going to be at the bar. So I'm just like, I'm going. Okay. Okay. Congratulations to your freedom. <laughs> Thank you. Thank right, you very sure. much. Yeah. yeah. Agreed. So, right on. Them, them, I don't know. Relationships and freedom can both be a gift and a curse, though. <laughs> yeah, absolutely, absolutely. They are yeah. both work. <laughs> Definitely enjoy it while it's enjoyable. While you have it now, yeah. Yep. Yeah, it's been over three years, so yeah. But I'm just getting older, so each time I, I'm single again, I'm just like, uh. yeah. <laughs> you're still beautiful. You still got the, You still got it out there. Get out there. Get out I, there I wasn't talking about happen. me. I was talking about the selection of men. Oh damn! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't know about this. They're still beautiful or not? <laughs> you know, hey, no, no, no. You know, they say uh, men, men, men don't get old. They just get distinguished. You know what I mean? That's not true. That's not true. <laughs> I want to believe that. I want to okay, believe that. Like it may be true for most, but there's that's definitely what I tell I mean, there's myself, exceptions though. to every rule. Well, that's what I'm gonna tell myself too. Yeah, that's what I tell myself. You know what I mean? Like, hey, you got you got gray hair now, or or, or how Wanda said platinum hair. So you know, that just means I'm a little more distinguished, right? Like, I don't necessarily mean that I'm old now. It just means I'm a little more distinguished. I'm a distinguished gentleman now. There you go. Yeah. Distinguished is not a word to describe women, though. So no, right. that's all for me. That's one of those things that you don't say you too whenever somebody tells you that you're handsome. Right. Yeah, you too. Yeah, you don't want to. Call a woman distinguished or handsome. Yeah. Or that other word. Or that other word. Yeah. Which one? Some other words I can think of too. I don't know. I don't get easily offended, so I probably don't know which word you're talking about off the off the bat. I see. I'm still yet. I'm not trying to say it. (laughs) Oh, you have you have women in your. uh, Oh, get off the keyboard. All right, get off the keyboard. All right, baby. Um, yeah, there's women in the chat. You probably don't want to say it. <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't want to say it anyway. Now, if I was on somebody else's channel, maybe. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Indeed. What's up, Floyd? Mr. Floyd Chavez in the house. I gotta start doing these damn interviews. I'm supposed to interview him for his cars. My car channel. I know, man. I was supposed to do the interview the other night and. Sat down to do it, and then I was just fucking scrapped it all, bro. Because I, I was just, who was that going to be? It wasn't right. Like my energy wasn't right. Like I didn't. I wasn't feeling it. Like I don't feel right. No, I know it could have been a whole lot better. So, so forget it. Yeah. If if it's, if it's, if you're not feeling it, then you probably shouldn't be doing it until it feels right. 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 Interview you for know? what? Uh, interview. Just a, any, I mean, what anything, like anything, really, really alive, yeah. alive, uh, pre recorded, any of it. Like, if you ain't feeling it, like, if you ain't feeling like, yeah, you can go to your gut. Because, like, go what I, I just I describe it as, like, when I'm on YouTube, like, I try to be myself, 
just right. turn it up a little bit. You know, because um, I'm like I'm normally I'm a really laid back dude that don't really say a whole lot. I'm very like I'm quiet. I'm observant, but you know, but you're you on YouTube, so like that, YouTube. Like, yeah. <laughs> and that won't work. You know, unless you want to be one of them channels that's like a silent live that has 150 <laughs> viewers. I don't know how it would. You know, maybe uh, I should do that. I mean. Yeah. Yeah, you just have an ASMR channel. You're just talking really softly like this, and then you could just be yourself. I can't talk that soft though. Like, my <laughs> <laughs> voice only works a certain type of way. Really, um, I don't know. Like, I, I guess I could try to whisper. I guess. Yeah, you just gotta get really close to the mic. Yeah. Wait, I didn't hear that. Say again. <laughs> whisper that. You can it. See. See? <laughs> Kick you across. Thing. <laughs> Just like that. Thanks for dropping in dirty weather. Thanks, dirty Thanks for weather. dropping oh, in okay. dirty weather. So, so is that is that storm still beating on your house? Yeah, yeah. Not yeah. as not as severe though. But so, I hear the rain. rain. I can't hear the rain. That's oh. a good song. I like that. We sent, we sent all the rain we had here somewhere. Ooh, I can't the rain. Yeah. Who turned out the lies? Uh, Megan, so is that a local spot, not, not too far from the pad and stuff? That you're going to? Oh, yeah, no, it's not far. Cool. It's the local uh, watering hole. It's the, it's the best bar in town. They have the best prices, the best pour. Cool, cool, cool. It's hard to go to another bar when it's like, why am I going to pay double for less? Right. And so, the bartenders are, are decent. Everybody knows you there. Everybody knows each other there, right? Mm -hmm. cool. Everybody knows your name. And I'm not going to go there to talk shit about the boyfriend. I'm definitely not going to say anything negative because those are mutual friends of ours and I'm just not going to be that bitch. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I like yeah. the high road. It smells better up here. Yeah. That's, that's okay. definitely the way to go. Yeah. You can always go to sleep. You can sleep well at night knowing that mm -hmm. that ain't you. Right. Yeah. Because there are some people out here, man, that, that they would like... dedicate to destruction. <laughs> and then there's those people that just go at it. Fuck that guy. This and that. Mm. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, that's not yeah. it. Yeah, I got a, I got a, arrested on Valentine's. Well, the night before Valentine's Day, but it was midnight by the time I was back there. And it's like all these women were just like assault, assault, DUI, assault, assault, and they're just all talking like just mad shit about their men. Cause they all got in fights. Uh, like, Valentine's Day. Like, yeah. <laughs> and I'm just like, okay, I'm not here for assault. <laughs> wow. Fake holiday. That fake holiday, yeah. yeah it is. <laughs> that, that manipulated Definitely. holiday. Man. So, I said, be good to her all the time. Manipulation and pressure. Hmm. But spending 75 bucks on some roses at any other time of the year or a lot less than that. Yeah. Like, and you know what I mean? It's dumb. Like what we celebrate Valentine's Day for, we have anniversaries for, which are individual and original and personal to each couple mm -hmm. not just right. one mass day of everybody go buy some shit um, yeah that's crazy i mean battle for the damn restaurant spot right it's no it's, it's kidding and, and, and the mad dash uh, last minute for roses and shit <laughs> yeah i mean if you participate in valentine's day and you making a mad dash for roses that's your fault you know yeah. what i'm saying like, yeah. Yeah, I don't need to do that. Hey, maybe you should or not participate. Something unique, the original. Right. That's what our, that's that's what our that's what Appreciate. our anniversaries are for, though. Like, yeah, if yeah, I was yeah, going to celebrate Valentine's Day, I would rather do it on some random ass day like July eighth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that way, I could have my own Valentine's Day and my own relationship, and and, mm -hmm. and it'd be warm, it'd be nice. I could do anything I wanted to do, and not a hundred thousand people would be standing in line exactly. for me to do the same thing. You know, what, babe, tonight we're gonna celebrate our love. Yeah, yeah. Right. You don't need a manipulated, pressurized 
quote unquote mm-hmm. holiday. But and it's crazy. You see people doing that. You're like, dude, you know, you don't have to subscribe to that stuff. You know, you don't. I've seen some some people just go nuts if they don't get their way on Valentine's Day. I'm saying well, that's a okay. mental problem. What is Valentine's Day even like? It's a, it's. A, February 14th, like, is there some sort of a saint or, uh, I know there is a Saint Valentine or something, but like, uh, some uh, saint Valentine. historic thing that happened but if that you, we're celebrating? I, I don't notice, like, I could be wrong right now, right? Like, somebody can Google it up, but I would be willing to say, like, m- a bunch of our holidays, it's probably traces back to something pagan. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. they all shadow pagan holidays. Too. Yeah, most of them do. Yeah. Yep. I would exactly. dare to say that. So I don't know. It's yeah. true. But it's, That's it's true. Weird. Uh, it's, it's weird that, that folks, it's weird that folks tell you what you're going to do in your relationship on that day. And if you don't do it, not me. Like you're a <laughs> fucked up person. Yeah. You, if you don't love her. <laughs> That's weird, bro. Love her or him, you know? If yeah. you break that down logically, it's weird. Are you right? Okay? Yeah, are you okay? It's weird. Like, I, you know I mean? I don't, bro, I don't do well with being told to do anything. Yeah. And, and I being manipulated, I do even worse. Right. So, uh, maybe I'm just a dick. I don't know. Like, it's possible. Yeah. It's just you and you, 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 just, what you do, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah you're not going to go with the masses when it's something that makes no sense. Now, if you, yeah, but like what you're saying, Chris, if you want to do that, if y'all, if that's how y'all want to roll, or whoever it is, like, that's cool. Like, I ain't knocking right. you for it. Right. Just don't knock me for not. You know what I'm saying? Like, because a lot of people that do it like to knock the ones that don't because they Screw got in the trap of doing it. They're stuck yeah. doing that shit. Yeah. Just because I bit my own leg off to get out the trap don't mean that I need to be punished more. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. 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 I think uh I think most people should take your cue on that and just be like, let's celebrate Valentine's Day and like our favorite time of the year. Right. Just be our <laughs> personal private thing. And you know, we can do the gondolas, but we're not gonna be competing with people. Yeah. yeah, and wouldn't that be the, the more beautiful shit. of a thing? That would be more romantic. Yeah, mm-hmm. not having to do it when everybody else is, is told to do it, you know? That's yeah. the pressure part. The manipulate, yeah, that's what it's all about. Like, you know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. For me, it was and another so, one. If, so next person you get in a relationship with, Megan, you let them know out the gate. Look, we celebrate in our Valentine's Day on June 14th. <laughs> Don't even come at me with no motherfucking flowers on February 14th. <laughs> You'll be wasting time and money, good sir. Right. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, I, I already say that. I remember the first Valentine's Day with this last guy. He was just like waiting all day for like the shoe to drop for me to get mad that he, he, he just didn't ignore my request to not do Valentine's Day and, and do something that surprised me. And I'm like, no. Hey, but are but, you gonna but, do that but, to me? Are you gonna get mad at me for uh for not doing something for you on Valentine's Day? He's like, no, and I'm like, okay. <laughs> but um, what's up, Jojo? You know, there's a lot of women that say that kind of thing, and if you don't do it, it's like a big trap. Like, That's what he was waiting for. Right. you play that yeah, game. Yeah. yeah, there's a lot of women like, know. yeah, they will do that. Like, you better do something. Not yeah. me. I like to be a woman of my word. So if I say that Valentine's Day is no big deal, I'm not going to be like, well, now it's a big deal. Yeah, no. yeah. Them games. Oh, like, yeah, that's, like, I don't think a lot of people realize that those those little games that you play, like through the mm-hmm. beginning of your relationship and stuff like that, that's the stuff that in the end builds up to break the camel's back in relationship. Right. 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 Yeah. All those little games. Yeah. Them little games, they add up. Like, and they get old. Up. Five years <laughs> they into break it, the foundation. they make the foundation shake. Uh, and like, whenever stuff happens and you don't fix it properly, like you 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 fixing broken arms with band aids, and you do that over and over. You know what I mean, like them arms are not gonna hold up. Not healed, yeah. There's a, ain't nothing healed up there. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's just hard though, man. Any any relationship, friendship, I mean parenting, any any relationship is hard. 
people manipulate other people to get to do what they want to do. You know, yeah. even, even like like say, uh, yeah. I'm gonna start a fight so this way I could go on with the guys or something. You know, mm-hmm. it's a lot of crap. Yeah. People play out there. You know, Bro, I hate you have to do that. You know, I hate it yeah, so I'm gonna go out with the guys. You know, that's it. Shit. I never questioned my boyfriend when he was out. Is only I only got mad at him whenever he would tell me like. Hey, we're going to do this, or I'm going to come home at this time, you know, or I'm coming home right now. And then it's like, all right, and I'll get ready for him to be coming home. And then he's like, nah, he stops at another bar or, or there's no drink. I'm like, then don't, don't tell me you're on your way home until you're on your way home. Like, that's what I have a problem with. You're affecting my schedule. Right. But I never questioned like, who's he, who he's hanging out with, what he did all night. That's why I'm like, don't tell me you're coming home until you're coming home. Like, why, why is that so hard? True that, true that. Oh yeah. yeah, he had a knack for not doing what he said he was going to do. So I'm like, that just makes you a liar. <laughs> That's just not good all the way around. I mean, I would want I would want to be a person of my word. So to me, it's like a big deal. Hey, when I was um, when I was out there wilding, living that crazy life, I would say shit like that. Like, look, I'll be home in a half hour with every intention. Of being home mm-hmm. in a half hour, but then something like I would have to make this money, or this play would be running low, slow, or I really needed to go over here and pick this shit up because I've been waiting all day and they hadn't called me. But as soon as I just called and told you I was gonna be on my way home, and it happened, it hit me up, and I had to when make that stop. Anytime time. I make that stop, there it's gonna take me at least an hour. You know what I mean, like, um, you know what I mean, and they'll make the calls. I'm like, yo. Bro, I, I'm not gonna be there, um, you know. Like, I, I, there's lots of times I had every intention of being there, man, and didn't make it. But you know, nowadays I live a whole different type of life. So if I said I was coming, the only thing that would hold me up would be something like a wreck or something. You know what I mean? Some catastrophe or something. But um, back then, man, there was all kinds of things that had a pull on me. You know what I mean? So like, if this happened, like. It's stuff that I felt like this has to be done. Like it, it has to be done. Like this is this is part of my money, or this is part of the way that I stay functioning, or whatever it was. It, it just had to be done. So, you know I mean, if I didn't take care of that, then everything at home and everything that you are enjoying when you're at home is going to suffer, and that's going to take a backseat. So, like I, I, I mean, I justified it and. I still had every intention of doing it. It's just something that couldn't happen at that point. And I'd feel bad about it too, but I couldn't, like, I wouldn't allow myself to feel that bad about it because I justify it, like I said. Can't have to do something. Yeah. I got every intention. Yeah, but when it's like, when it's like every time, that's when it's just like you have a problem with this. When it's like it's silly telling bad. people what you think they want to hear and not having any intention of doing it yeah. makes you an a, unreliable, bad, you know, like. And if you're just out partying, if you're just out partying and doing what you want to do type of thing, that's a little different too. Yeah, that's what it was. And I was fine with him being out partying. I had no problem with that. Wow. We were very confident in our relationship. Like, I didn't worry about that at all. And uh, I was just like, just don't, don't don't lie to me. Don't tell me that you're coming home. Like I just don't like that. Yep. Oh, yeah, that sucks. Man. I would get I would get over that too. Well, it just gets old ones all the time. But anyways, I didn't come up here to bitch about him. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You better not get us started, but we can get into it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dive That's into it. That part. What's up, man? You ready to wrap this thing up, man? It's 12 30. It's yeah. uh 30 minutes after I said wrap it up before. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I'll probably go live a little bit later. A little while, but yeah, I got a couple things to do real quick. But yeah. Uh Thanks appreciate for everybody. Hey, it was I'm great meeting you, man. Let you guys say bye to your audience. Thanks for letting yeah. me up though. Appreciate Definitely. you, Megan. It was great meeting you. Uh, uh, be safe tonight. Yeah, she's Absolutely. awesome. It's a pleasure meeting you, Chris, as always. Have a good one. Got it. I <laughs> you do. Right on. Hey, that's yeah. cool, man. I didn't expect to meet Megan tonight. Right. Right on. So, what, 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 what do you think, man? 
Aber, mm. aber, aber do mine too. And, uh, you know, we'll be back on, on next Thursday, but um, I'm going to make it a point to be more prepared, more more here, you know, be here on time and, and we'll rock and roll with some, with some good, uh, good ideas, good, good topics to discuss, you know. Yeah. We'll take, we'll have that. Uh, we we yeah, always man. something. Yeah, man, we we figure out something, bro. We I mean, we had decent numbers tonight, man. From I'm pretty sure we'll get off here and it'll look pretty decent. Like we had good numbers all through the night. Nice, nice. I mean, yeah, like yeah. nothing crazy or nothing, but I mean, good, yeah, decent. Yeah, that's good. 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 But yeah, I'll man. Go. Hey, bro, I appreciate you, homie. I appreciate you, brother. That's for sure. 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 I'll uh, I'll talk to you on the outside in between then and now. Right now and then, yes, sir. Way it goes. All right, crap. Oh, wait, yeah. there in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> there it goes. Where is he at? Where is he at? Uh, everybody in the chat, man, we appreciate you greatly. Appreciate everybody who's stuck in there with us all the way to the end. You mean right when we about to hang this jank up, the numbers start going back up, but it's all right. Y'all can hit the replay game and uh, replay game. next Thursday, I mean, 10 o'clock, seven o'clock on the west coast. There you go. Until then, man, y'all already know. So much love and respect. Keep it kicking. Keep it kicking. We out. Keep kicking. Keep kicking.